Welcome back to TCG Chase. We're at it again with Crown Zenith. We have our third and final legendary bird tin going up against loose packs. This time the loose packs have a little bit of backup. We have one of the Cinderace pin sets as well. Uh, so hopefully that can help push the loose packs over the top to win the final versus. Let's get into it. Okay, so you see back there. So we have the third and final legendary bird tin, Zapdos. Very cool. All those promos are cool. Chasing a dude, Doug Trio maybe? Yeah, it looks like Doug Trio. Let's crack this open. We can have a closer look at this promo card. Still gonna pull it out of the pack. Beautiful card, eh? Very nice. Got your yellow border still. So we'll pull out our five packs out of the 10. Boom. Check this back on. Here we go. Close it up, put the packs against it. I think what we'll do, now why don't we start with the 10? I was gonna start on the other side, but we'll start with the 10. And then let's see, it's stacked on the, the other side. So let's see what we can do. 10 first, let's do it. Or should we go for one for one? Hmm. Let's do that, I like that better. One for one, okay, I'm gonna open the Cinderace pack. Back in a sec. Okay. So we got the Cinderace pin collection. Beautiful Cinderace promo card. Nice. And here's code card. Nice. nice pin as well we got. Boom. Okay, but for this side, so now, why don't we separate them? We've got loose packs, pen, put Cinderace back here. And we're gonna go one for one until it's just loose and we'll keep going. Okay, start with the left side. Let's do it. Can the loose packs with some additional help win today? Can we pull our one of our chase cards still after the Pikachu Secret Rare and also the Deoxys V Max from the Galarian Gallery? And also, we haven't pulled any of the four gold cards or the Mewtwo V Max, so all those cards are really my big chases at the moment. Let's see what we can do. Open tons of packs to date. So you expect to have gotten one by now, but I'm feeling good today. Turtwig, I think I have like four of these and I have like four of each of the four. There's nine to collect, of course. Mewtwo, nice. Not the right Mewtwo, but it's all right. Good start, good start. Okay, now loose packs. So we'll do, do like halfway, clean up, and then we'll finish it off. We're on one for one. Don't know how much that Cinderace is worth, but it definitely helps the uh, loose pack sign. Just even have the promo. Four from the back, swinging around. Which side is going to give us the massive luck we need to pull one of these big cards? Grubbin, Scrap, Helicopter, Wooloo. Ooh, Thievil. I don't think I have the Thievil yet. It's a cool card. Nice. Looks like he's thieving something there. And Zashian. Hollow. Might not have that. Okay, that's all right. On the board, on the board. Pretty similar. Okay, good start. Back to the 10. <coughs> Let's see. Ooh, that was a very clean pack. Probably should have saved that one. Four from the back. Chuck the V Storm marker. Okay. Catcher. Slazzle. Rare Candy. Oddish. Sandlodite. Energy Search. Wooloo. Grubbin. Ooh, Luxio Reverse. And. Oh, yeah, that was not a good pack. Okay, time for the loose packs to make up some ground here. Let's see what we can do. So far to date, the tens have been pretty stacked, the legendary bird ones, so I would recommend picking some up if you can. Uh, yeah, if you check out the first one of these, oh my god, it was just, it was Pulse City on both sides. A Whalmer and Executor. I don't know if I have that, but. So pretty, still pretty equal. Okay, back to the 10. Maybe we'll do a couple more and then we'll clean. Again, that was a very clean opening. There we go. Four from the back. Okay, I expect the 10 to be, hits the rest of the way. So Croc Rock, Scrub, Grubbin, Helicopter, Wooloo, Shanks. Ooh, another Radiant Shanks, that's sick. This is my third, so this was one of my chase cards. Uh, and I've pulled three now, so that's sick. Happy with that. 
and Reggie Gigas face start. Very nice, very nice. Like I said, 10's gonna come through. Chuck Charizard and a sleeve. There it goes. Okay, back to the loose packs. Can they come up with similar? Gotta stay even, don't wanna fall behind. If we pull one of these big cards, they'll really just go crazy in terms of a head. So whatever side so can pull one of those, that would help. Really have it stand out. Claim Smime, Sunker, and Coughing, Oddish, Sam Ledite, and oh, Wailord, and oh yeah, oh no. A loose pack's getting killed. Okay, one more and then we'll clean up. Two, three, four, flip it around. Is the 10 gonna really separate itself now? It has a bit of a lead. Oh, two cards there, Badoof. Potion, old school potion, Glaring Mr. Mime, Sun Kern, Coughing, Snorunt, and Luxray, nope. Okay, so we'll clean up and come right back. Okay, and we're back. So, just to recap, a 10 is ahead. Loose packs do have some backup, an extra two from the Cinderace pin collection. Still haven't got any big pulls. Like, we do keep getting that Radiant Charizard, which is amazing. Love Charizard. Uh, but, jeez. I would have thought some gold cards, maybe one of the other chase cards at this stage. So, just always seems to be those mid lane hits. I see people pulling them from these things, but. <laughs> Probably my 17th Turtwig. And, Kyogre Okay, yuck. Uh, yeah, I'll give you there. Okay, last pack from the pin, or from the uh, legendary bird tin. Can we go to the bang? Last pack. Got one of each of the legendary bird tins. Been good, but no massive hits. So, come on, guys. You can do it. Matang. Energy switch. Trekking shoes. Oh, sun current. Badoof. Coffee. Sand Ledite. Purloin. I think it's here. Ooh, Zoror V Star. That's a sick hit. Very, very nice. Don't think I have that yet. Nice. Lots of Zorora cards in here. Pretty much all the other ones, so I think this might have been the last one. And is there something behind it? No, Snorlax. Cool Snorlax card, but... Okay, so... The Legendary Bird Tin has a massive lead at this stage. Is it possible... Is it possible for... The Loose Packs and the Collection to catch up? We will see. So, <clears throat> now we're into the Cinderace Collection box packs. Three packs. Let's see what we can do, guys. You can still have those massive hits. That's Zoro V starts big hit. Probably the biggest so far. <clears throat> okay. Let's flip it around. This is this going to be a really lucky box? Cinderace one. Tangela, Ball Toy, and Meowth. Let's see, there might be something. Bidoof. Oh, do I have a Bidoof? Probably. Blossom, okay. So a Bidoof as well. It's not what we're looking for though. It's not what we're looking for, guys. We're looking for a big banger to just knock it out of the park on this side. Now, so now it's about even. Now it's two extra packs on the Cinderace side, loose pack side. Four from the back. This is my mind now. Okay, Ultra Ball, Slazzle, Dusclops, oh, two cards. Larvista, Oddish, Seal, Potion. Ooh, Radiant Eternatist. Not the most expensive card, but nice hit, nice hit. And Land Preserka, oh no. Looks like it's gonna be a clean sweep for the Legendary Bird Tins. It's gonna win all three versus despite me stacking it, giving a little bit of a extra leg up for the loose packs this opening. Wow. Okay, so definitely pick up those tins. Okay. Pick up those tins if you are looking to buy some Crown Zenith, because they are great. But let's see, can we get some of the last pack magic here to really balance it out? Take the win. Yanma, Pinard, Riolu, Reverse, no. And Leafeon V, no. Sadly, no. The Lots of hits on the right side, but they're all quite small, whereas the left side, lots of big hits. You got the Charizard, the Zorora V-Star, Regigigas. Again, the legendary bird tin comes through with the quality polls. Thanks everyone for watching. Until next time, see ya.